Hello, in this short video we're going to go over uh, Blockchain Explorers. So Bitcoin Blockchain Explorer is a tool that we have at our disposal as a user of the Bitcoin blockchain. It's an online blockchain browser that displays the content of individual Bitcoin blocks and transactions, as well as any transaction history and balances of all Bitcoin addresses. Blockchain.com is a good blockchain explorer to utilize. If you were to click on one of the addresses, you can see the location and other details of the transaction, like the size. Keep in mind, this goes to show that Bitcoin is not completely private, but there are ways to make it more private, like using Bitcoin mixing services, if you're interested in that. It is just something you need to know exists if you are a Bitcoin user, but you usually do not need to do much with a blockchain explorer, but you can also do things like check if your transaction has confirmed or is still waiting to be confirmed. So it's just basically uh, to see what transactions are doing, how much Bitcoin addresses have, and a couple other uh, statistics. Um, I'm also going to touch on a UTXO. It stands for Unspent Transaction Output. So if you see it somewhere, that's what it stands for. UTXOs are outputs of a transaction which are not yet inputs of another transaction. I mean, it you don't have to know this, but if it comes up somewhere now, at least you'll know what it is. And um, at the end of this video, stay tuned. I'm going to have a short uh, video showing uh, how to use a blockchain explorer and some of the different features of a blockchain explorer. Um, that will be coming up next. Okay, I'm here on blockchain.com, and here is a blockchain explorer for Bitcoin. You can look at other ones there as well, Ethereum and Bitcoin Cash. So it displays the price, the estimated hash rate, number of transactions in the last 24 hours, transaction volume in Bitcoin, and it goes over the mempool size. These are amount of transactions waiting to be confirmed pretty much. There's price chart, gives you the latest blocks, who mined the block, size of the block, latest transactions, has every transaction that's happening. Um, have daily active addresses here, total addresses with balance, number of large transactions, ownership by time held, concentration, uh, east first west transactions. I mean, it just has all kinds of different info. You can actually even dive deeper and see a bunch more stuff. I'm not going to go over that. I was just showing you what you can do here. So if you did a transaction and you wanted to search that transaction, you just copy the transaction uh, ID and paste it up here, and then you could search it, and then you could see information on it. I'll just click on a transaction so you can see you can see all the different information of the transaction the hash different addresses uh, the receiving address the fee and you can see right here if the transaction is confirmed or unconfirmed this transaction is still unconfirmed you can see receive time weight size how many confirmations it's had and of course this one hasn't had a confirmation yet it's not confirmed uh, total input, total output, fee, fee per byte, fee per weight unit, and value when transacted. And I mean, there's other information you can look at too, but I'm just using this as an example so you can kind of see what a blockchain explorer is. You're welcome to dive deeper into it uh, at your own pace and kind of to understand the different things, but that's all I'm going to go over in this video. Thank you. Hope everyone has an amazing day. I'll leave a link in the description to blockchain.com as well. Thank you for watching.